Hello. <clears throat> Good Hello. morning. Good morning. This, uh, this is just so fun. We just love this. I'm going to finish opening my birthday cards and then a few of you sent anniversary cards. Today is our 49th anniversary. So next year's the big one. I, I, I just am overwhelmed that we even get anniversary cards. You guys are just the best. Tomorrow is Tim's birthday. He's going to start the day at 10 in the morning by opening his cards. So we'll see how far we get tomorrow with that. We'll do that. And then we're going to go to Hank's baseball game. And then who knows what for the rest of his. I think I have about 5,000. <laughs> yeah, he thinks so anyway. Thank you for um, spending this time. So these are all cards we've gotten from you guys. We just feel spoiled rotten and we love it. Every bit of it. Okay. Tim is still. Um, he's going to keep working on uh, Slice. opening, slicing some of them open. So I'm going to get started. Okay. Oh, thank you guys for the happy anniversary. And we uh, love having you guys. Oh, this is beautiful. Lisa Holland from Connecticut. Oh, my goodness. This is beautiful. Look at this oversized quilt card. And look what she did in the inside. Love that. The cut flowers. This is such great paper because you can fussy cut it. There are dies also, so you can do both. But I, you know, I fussy cut all the time. So I make lots of cards like that. I love that. And this is paper from that, the little squares. That is a beautiful card. Thank you. <clears throat> so fun. And then we have, okay, one of these is for Tim. So I'm going to leave this in. Figure out, okay, this isn't, this one's mine. And this is from Jan Eagleson from Missouri. And I'm going to put Tim's over there. Oh, the pinwheel card. Love it. Look at that in the purples. I just think that is so pretty. I love that. That is wonderful. Um, <laughs> you get lots of cards on your birthday. What about after? Who's thinking of you then? I am. That's who me. I'm not late. I'm sensitive. <laughs> People late at birthday. Oh, that is hilarious. <laughs> oh, what a great inside. That is perfect. Uh, Sue Fisher from Illinois. Happy, 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 happy. Love this. Happy, 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 happy birthday. How cool is that? And a strip there. What a beautiful card. And how fun to just pull out all those colors. And another strip on the inside. That is wonderful. <laughs> so pretty. Oh, we have some purple is kind of a theme here. And I love purple. So that's really fun. This is Kathy Boggs from Washington. Oh, I, I'm just making a mess here, Tim, because he's busy slicing, so I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out afterwards. Oh, that is stunning. Look how gorgeous this card is. Ooh, and it's one of these that flip up. Isn't that gorgeous? And that pansy, those pansy dies are just absolutely stunning. Kathy, that is a gorgeous card. How fun is this? And then we have Cindy Jolson from here in Minnesota. Cindy is here, up here. Oh, one of my... Monday Mavens. So how fun is that? And I love, love this card. How fun is that? So we have the little strip of designer series paper, adding a little stamping and the words and the ribbon. What a nice, great layout. Very fun. Um, <clears throat> Jean Woody from Texas. Ooh, look how pretty this is. This is the die that we're giving away this week too. That, um, <clears throat> Huh, I just have a, I guess I haven't talked. I don't talk that much in the morning. Um, that I was given by Beverly Hammer as an extra one. She ordered two and sent. So this, look how stunning this is in black um, and the papers under it. So that is awesome. That is beautiful. Uh, then we have from Pat McHale in Florida. I just love seeing what all the states are that people are from. Isn't that fun to use a die on the inside? And here, she's just got the paper here. And then the accent goes across through the ribbon with the accent there. So another fun layout. <clears throat> Tim will be opening anniversary cards with me at the end. And he's opening his birthday cards tomorrow morning at 10. And this is Nina Rapaline from Hawaii. Okay, I'm thrilled to get this. This is fun. This is the paper pumpkin. And I actually didn't make mine because it came when we were in Norway, but it is just an absolutely stunning one. Usually I do a video with alternatives, but I just didn't because we were gone. But isn't this just stunning? These make the most beautiful cards. Just look how pretty that is. Oh, what a popular set. They could um, they could bring that back. Ruth Vickers from California. 
love this little love this little die and um to notice about this oh and she's thanking me for uh she got a, a, a gift from us in one of the weekly drawings you know we do drawings every week over in the back porch stampers when people post their things so this is a thank you card but I wanted to notice sometimes that we notice how when cards are un oversized they make a statement the same is true when they're undersized this is the smallest size oh Tim went and got me some water how nice it is our anniversary. I do not. So, <laughs> so, Usually I wouldn't, but it's our anniversary. Yeah, that's right. That's right. <laughs> and I don't have a cold or anything. It's just, I just suddenly my voice is just, but anyway, um, I think the undersized card like this too looks just absolutely so sweet. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Tim has a rhythm here and I'm, I'm doing my best to mess it up. And this is Elise Graf from Minnesota. Oh, this is beautiful. And look how fun this is. So another idea with your designer series paper. Do you see how she's just cut off one end of it down here? So most of it is the stripes and then we have this accent. So if you make a card like this, you're gonna make two because then the other one's gonna have this on top and that on the bottom. Another great way to get two cards at once. And I love how she's colored in, just added the color to go with that. That is beautiful. I'm gonna tell them what I'm doing so I don't have to. <clears throat> I don't have to talk. Oh uh, yeah, Tim, <laughs> you, go put it under here. T is a, he's got his trusty knife here. And he's trying to slice these to stay ahead of me. I asked him, are my cards ready? He says, oh, nope. <laughs> and, and, and they weren't because I was making care of breakfast. I know. So see, his day never ends. So um, what I am made, I going to do for him? huh? And I made the bed this morning. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> Pam Brodsky from New York. Oh, yeah. He's he, he's on top of life. I made her tea. Okay. Th okay. This is gorgeous. Look at how fun this is. Uh, that is so wonderful. I'm trying to see, I think this is, this is just, uh, I can't decide if she's actually put these strips together. It feels a little bumpy there. Um, but, but look at this layout, whether or not she did. <laughs> How cool is that with the thin little pieces in between the other? So this would be a great idea for a card. But then that is so funny that I cannot figure that out. It might be just, and then she's added the happy birthday. Love it. Luba Balix from New York. Oh man, here's a card for me. Oh, Luba, you know me. This is just where I started my day. It's where I end my day outside on the back deck. <laughs> I just love it. That is, oh, look, you got, and then see, I have that extra thing of tea for anyone who wants to join me because it's all casual here. Oh, look, and she's even done the inside. That is fabulous. What, what a gorgeous card. <laughs> And so Gail, you and your husband just celebrated 45 years. Oh, time is a way of going, doesn't it? I don't know where it goes, but Lynn Meringer from Wisconsin. Oh, how pretty. Now, you see how she's taken a square of paper, cut it, and moved the two pieces of paper this way, and then added her decorations. And she's got the brick under there. Beautiful. Beautiful. And all these notes that I'm going to go sit outside afterwards and read. Lisa Oberly from Maine. Oh, how fun. This, this was designer series paper from a couple years ago in celebration. And do you see how she's torn it? Now, Masterfully Made, which is a, uh, you know, th this whole torn look is a real look right now. It, it's actually in the Masterfully Made designer series paper. But you can also make your own out of anything. I really like that idea of the tearing and the layers and then the dragonflies. That's just really lovely. Yeah, Tim is being kind of silent because he's really busy working. And then it's perfect to add in one more torn because those are all torn, one more on the inside. So great way. <clears throat> I'll have him do the anniversary cards. Sandy Sextor from Nebraska. Okay, stinking cute. Love, love, love this guy. It's envelope flap card. I'm going to open it and open it and drop down. That is so that cool. Love it. Oh, I noticed that. Love I thought, this. Yep. I thought, I thought this was the envelope and there was nothing in it. But then I turned it yep. over and I realized. And do you remember when you made, you made, no oh, idea. he doesn't remember uh, when we made these, he made one with a car and we made them sideways. And then I love seeing, I get them um, a whole different angle going this way. So it's so fun. Just taking ideas and running with them. And then Renee Duchesne. Oh, and I just saw her name up here. Ooh, this is stunning. Look at this, some major watercoloring going on. That is so awesome. 
Um, wow. Yeah, if you're on here, that uh, I just absolutely love what you did. Renee, you're out doing it. And I'm, I'm guessing you wet the paper first. I'm gonna have to talk to you about this because thought oh, that would be a fun, fun card to make. I. Um, on a Thursday, because I've been wanting to do a watercoloring again, but I love your card. So we'll have to talk about that. I'm gonna set that there. There's a check in there, I've got it. Okay, uh, Teresa Courtney from Iowa. Uh, thank you, card. There's, oh, I think this is, is this from one of the new card kits that I don't have either yet? Um, you guys have to tell me, but I think that is absolutely beautiful. Boy, I love it if it is. I love it even if it isn't. So Sharon Scheifler from Tennessee. Okay, here's another one for me. This is where I'd like to be sitting. Yep, and I've got my tea, uh, watching all the wilderness around. I think these diorama, those kind of dies are just so fun to cut. Almost like you're looking at things. Yeah, yeah, I wish. But this is a, uh, I love sitting on a dock and doing that. That's what, and uh, when we go up to our church's camp and stuff, this is this is what we do. Oh, look, look at the fun little, a little uh, extra one in there. That's really cool. Dana Barentine from North Carolina. Oh, how pretty is this? That is so fun. And she has, this is paper, and then it's gone through an embossing folder. So look at the rich texture you get. So then it's easy to just use that as a card, add your words, and you've got a beautiful card. Then we have Susan Bobach, who is on my team. Oh, look at this. How fun. Okay. So we have these shops. Okay, this, um, if we make the hair gray, this makes me think of when we were in London, Tim, doesn't it? Look oh, at that, looking at oh, the yes. shops yep. and all, you know, and all the bikes. Yep. Oh, what a fun, that is very cool. what a fun card. Ah, it's beautiful. And this is, uh, oh, Julie Heights. Uh, who is the ch the chirpy card maker? You guys know her. Julie is one of my team members that I'm doing the retreat, the Ink and Tiled retreat. Actually, today at one o'clock, the four of us are going to come on and just talk a little bit about retreat. So, um, just so we know that. But she made this. Oh, so we have um, other things planned for our anniversary. Mm -hmm. yeah, 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 yeah. I, I planned a fun day, Tim. Yeah. <laughs> so this is a card, and she does. Uh, Barn Quilts of the Month Club. So I encourage you to follow her if you haven't already and look at this gorgeous easel card. That is absolutely stunning. Beautiful. And Ink and Tiled is what we're going to be using keep that out. It's okay. keep um, for our retreat. LaVar Lashmet from Wisconsin. Ooh, look oh, how stunning this is. So how pretty. And I love how she's got what on the inside. So this is all done just with dyes. These are not Stampin' Up! dyes, but look how beautiful this is. Just adding dyes. And so it's a white card, which is that touch of green. Isn't that pretty? And then we have Marie Anderberry from Washington. Oh, I love this too. What a fun. So it's a gatefold card, but it overlaps a little. And do you see how she's used the edging to just give a different look to the front? That's gorgeous. Love that. Now we have Pat Walter from Ohio. <laughs> How cute is this? <laughs> Not a Stampin' Up! thing because I've never seen it. But that is that is so pretty. And it's got that double layer. Happy birdie to you. <laughs> oh, that is such an adorable card. That is so cute. <laughs> Love it. Norwegian cruise. This is our cruise ship. Oh, all right. Yo, look at this. Karen Stetson from Vermont. It certainly is. This is a perfect birthday card for me this time. It just looks like her waters. Oh, that is that is wonderful. I love it. <laughs> You've conquered another year. <laughs> Do you remember the uh, those Viking stamp set? That is so perfect. <laughs> what a great card. <laughs> and then we have Lonnie Rhodes from Florida. And... Oh, and it's a thank you card. Oh, how pretty is this? Oh, look, so it stands like this. So it's a lovely box card. It's actually a birthday card. Thanks for getting older. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> that is fabulous. And then we have from Faye Cunningham from Virginia. How pretty. So look at this accent. We just have a paper strip here. And a die cut and just 
anything pretty you want to put on it, look what a great layout that makes. That is beautiful. Then we have Sue Geis from Wisconsin. Well, how cute is this? So I love this layout too. Do you see how she's just got two pieces of designer series paper? Okay, you want this, but then she's got her bookmark. And I love that it's got just this little tiny balloon on there. Wishing you all the wishes, the little balloon. How cute. <laughs> Aren't these great cards? I know you guys are saying, but great cards. So I said, and I, you know, if you're like me, you like to look at cards over and over and over. So it's all Connie Burton from California. Boy, this seems to bring back memories. Is this an old Stampin' Up! set? Can somebody tell me? It looks, it reminds me of one, but I don't know if it is. I don't know if it's exactly the same or if it's something different, but look how pretty that is. Just colored in, layered a couple times on embossing folder. That is beautiful. Oh, and she's done the inside too. How lovely. Beautiful. Also known as Cindy Cunningham. Okay, Cindy Cunningham from California. Yep. Oh, Cindy, is it? No, what do you, not Cindy Otten. Otten. No. Oh, Cindy Cunningham Otten. Okay, Cindy? that's how I was trying to figure out what, what it is. Okay, <laughs> Tim didn't know what he's talking about. Surprise, okay. Surprise. Oh, look at this gorgeous Isa card. Look at that. Oh, that is beautiful. And so it stands like that as an easel card. That is beautiful. Happy birthday. Hope your day is fabulous. Gorgeous it's card. Oh my God, goodness, you guys. These are just fabulous cards. Fabulous. Then we have Amy. Oh, Kim. Oh, Kim Amstutz. I don't know if I say your name right. Uh, yeah, Amstutz. I, I never, I never remember, but love this card too. Um, is, is this great? You can put in a post-it note like that with a note. I just love this, but I love this with the smaller card on top for accent there. The paper again does the work. You add your words and you've got a gorgeous card. Then we have Nancy Young from South Carolina. Ooh, a belly band card. Good thing we didn't rip this. Tim's been famous for ripping someone wearing a rush, but look at that. I, uh, I love these peaches. This is a belly band card and it's a gate fold. So we open this <gasps> and it's a fun fold. That is gorgeous. Have a peachy day. Do you see how that opens? Oh, what a beautiful card that is. This one is kind of interesting because she has a, a, a folder for a check. Oh, interesting. Um, Connie Burton, the high. how fun is this? But this could also be for a note. I'm just thinking, look how cool what she did. I mean, that's really lovely too. Love this, just the stamp on the thing. But look how she decorated this middle and then she slipped the check inside. But what I'm thinking is that's a fun idea for anything you want to slip inside, to slip a little message. That's a fun idea for something you send to a kid too. Slip a little photo. But I thought, what a cute... Uh, Love that inside idea too. Um, just just a side thing, trying to figure where our piles go. Penny K from, or Cly or Clear, whatever from Nevada. Oh, here we have that uh, split um, die again. I, that is just anything split like that is just so pretty. Look at this. This is a beautiful card. I'm going to open it. And just like that, I'm just looking at the words and thinking, yep, it's going to go sideways. It could go either way except the words, which you can't really read. I see harvest. But I love that little vintage look on the, I don't know if you can see that, but that's gorgeous. It is. Beautiful cards. Jennifer Helm from Maryland. Oh, and another really easy and beautiful card. I love the bright colors mm -hmm. here. But you see how she's got this? And this is not, often we'll do like the quarter inch down that I always talk about. But look how you can use any size. So this is cut off and then this bridges over and it just makes this beautiful look, which gives you more white space there. So another just great layout. And then we have Tony Shaw, a book fold card. Look at that, that is so pretty. I, this paper it's actually from the Cheerful Daisies. It's one of the ones on one of the packs. Isn't that, isn't that pretty? And then she's just adding some dyes there with the flowers. So look how rich, very rich looking card. Then we have Joan Sheffley from California. We're getting to the end of mine. 
Mm, love this with the little squares and we have the dragonfly on top. How cute is that? And it's all good. And it is all good. Fun note in there. But how fun. Yeah, I like that. And it's all good. That's perfect. <laughs> per perfect art for me. <laughs> and then we have, ooh, love this quote card. This is Candace Carrier from Arizona. First, I just wanted to point out the inside. She added the extra little squares in there. Isn't that fun? Scattered? Because these are from that pinwheel goes, quilt card. Goes this way. Oh, okay. Isn't that pretty? Love that. And then she has done that and then gone through the embossing folder. So it looks extra quilted. Judy Bloom from Minnesota. Oh, here is that same die. Okay. Not die, but stamp set. Oh, this is so fun. What is springy? I really like that with the bird on the flower pot. How beautiful is that? So two of you were thinking alike. And I thought that's that's really a gorgeous stamp. They could uh, bring that one back if it if that's what it is. <laughs> but I love it. Jennifer Walsh from Minnesota. Oh, look how fun this is. Look what you can do with little calendar ideas. Isn't that fun? So Thursday, she's got my date there and then just add in the other. Oh, just think of all the things you could do with that. I, I got one from her. It was my birthday. Oh, did you? Because he yeah. peeks ahead at some of his, you know, so because that, that's just Tim's style. Well, I, I just wait and open I them here. I had to separate them out. They, had, they came oh. in the same envelope. Oh, okay. So. Carol Rudy from Ohio. Oh, pretty look at the, okay. This is a thick card, so I think it's going to have Ooh. a fun fold Ooh. and a note. Oh, fun. Look how this pops up. Hmm. So it sits like that. Oh, man. Beautiful card. That's a lot of work into that. that. And that's beautiful coloring. And a fun note that I will read afterwards. Beautiful. And Margaret Springer from Michigan. Mm, and how pretty with the flowers and the coming down like that and the happy birthday. Gorgeous card. White and white, with just touches of colors. That is gorgeous. Mary Touches from Minnesota. Another book binding card, one of my favorite folds, and it's so fun and easy. I absolutely love all that. It's just really, really pretty. And then we have last one for me, and then we're going to do a few anniversary cards. This is Petty Abrams from, I'm having trouble, Connecticut maybe? Oh, look at the fun border along the side here that she's done. On, and then the opposite inside. Oh, that's it cool. Is CT would be Connecticut. Okay. That is really cool. I love how she's interplayed mm -hmm. those. Okay, Tim, now you're on. Now we're on. Anniversary. Anniversary. Okay, but you're going to open it. Okay. Ginger Fabre from New York. Ooh, look at this. Homemade. She's even done that. Oversized card. Help me out here. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at how gorgeous. Oh, I think purple is, is the color of the day. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that pretty light lavender. That is so fun. Oh. Happy anniversary. And homemade envelope. Oh, look at that. That is really stunning. What a that gorgeous is. card. Oh, thank and you. And a fun note. The big bling on there. She she packaged it. In. Yeah. Yes, because it would need protection. Vesta Streeb. Um. Okay, pull the ribbons to open. Okay, this is for you, Tim. I'm going to pull the ribbons. This is a card from Vesta Stream. We're doing it together. Okay, we'll do it together. Okay. As people were asked. Okay, pull the, I think, well, let's see. I think we have to get it started. Oh, I think it might have glued itself. So. I think it just, okay, yeah, I think oh, it's just. Venetian lines. Okay, there. Yes. <gasps> And we have those. Look how cool that is. That is so Sending cool. Sending bright wishes. That's so fun. And then again, we can just lower it again. A lot of work. Oh, my goodness, yes. And it just pulls. I guess it just slides right up. Oh, see? I have to figure it out. Yeah. Oh, this looks like ours. You know, then we got to, then we have to adjust them. Love it. What a fun, fun card. It is. Thank you. Wanda Ball. Love is the key. Oh, <laughs> what a great anniversary card. Oh, that is so fun. Look at that. Just anything to do with the key. That's a really a fun, fun idea. And, and you know what key I have? The key to your heart. 
Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> well, if you say so, Jim. Jan Makaitis. <laughs> oh, good. The ha happy anniversary. Love the paper strip, the accent, Ooh. and the words. Beautiful. And one more. And this is, oh, how fun. Virginia Pender from California. And look, oh, Ooh. look how fun. This is certainly a Minnesota. She's from California, but it's also really a Minnesota scene. Look at that just rustic look to it all. That is absolute. I was just perfect. in California and I know they have deer out there too. Yes. You guys, thanks for spending this little time with us. I, um, I'll be back at one o'clock with three of my team members to talk about our retreat. And tomorrow at 10, Tim is going to work on his birthday cards. Thanks so much. We appreciate you.